We are engaged in a war. In the late 1950s, right in the middle of the Cold War, a Russian spy, Rudolf Abel, was captured by the FBI. The Bar Association went to James Donovan and convinced him to take on the defense of Rudolf Abel. We want you to defend him. I'm an insurance lawyer. I haven't done criminal work in years. James B. Donovan, he was what you would call the stand-up kind of guy that stands up for what he believes, which is justice for all. Everyone deserves a defense. Have you represented many accused spies? This will be a first for the both of us. You're going to be taking pictures over Soviet territory. They got our spy pilot. We've got their guy. We want you to negotiate the swap. Where do they want this negotiation to take place? East Berlin. I thought Tom was the obvious choice to play James Donovan. This was our fourth movie together. And the movies that I made with Steven were very different one from the other, you know. Saving Private Ryan was this emotional piece of historical documentation. The terminal was looking at American behavior at this time. And Catch Me If You Can was a dogged pursuit. That was fascinating. So when I read Bridge of Spies, I just knew, well, Stephen's going to have a field day here. We need to have the conversation our governments can't. We need this to be an exchange. No! Two cameras here, one over. They both love film, and they both love history. Tom is the perfect collaborator. He adds so much to the movie. I'm very comfortable coming to work with Stephen and showing him what I've got. He's the boss, but he's listening and seeing what I'm bringing to it. We are not leaving him here. They really bring out the best in one another. You should be careful. There are a lot of people that doesn't want this to ever take place. <laughs>